What's up guys? Well, I made it. I'm at the mini Maker Faire that we have here in Wichita. Uh, got me a program. Woohoo! And all that jazz. Looks like we've got some outdoor stuff um, right now. I don't know if you can see it behind me, but I've got some outdoor stuff. Let's see if I can turn. I got my kids with me and my family. They're blowing bubbles. Uh, they've got some blacksmithing. They've got all kinds of different things out here. So I'm going to run around. We're going to check some of this out, shall we? So got dinosaurs riding motorcycles. Should be good. So we'll see you in a little bit. Here's the hall that has everything in it. Uh, different things. There's a seashell exhibit over there. Looks like there's some other stuff. We'll go check it all out. Alright, I'm here with the 3D printing booth. One of them that this one, they print, it actually mixes the colors to where it'll print and all in three different colors is how it'll work. So, let me back off to get a shot of the printer. Right now, I believe they're printing another one of those that I just showed. Side shot here. It's all three colors. Going up into the feeders, into the deal. About 48 hours to print that. So it does take a little bit of a while, but if you try to do some kind of geographical map, try to show you can read things and whatnot. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what I thought was like topographical maps and stuff. Then you, you do you mind if I get you in there too? Okay, cool. <laughs> I also got my little buddy here too. Oh, what we got? He's, uh, These are all 3D printed? Yep, his body's all 3D huh. printed. Then he has uh, a lithium polymer battery strapped to an Arduino. Running about uh, seven different uh, seven different servos. Wow! That control everything from his, uh, his head movement. Oh wow! To his wings. <laughs> That's awesome. How did it take to design something like that? Uh, this guy took me about a year and a half to design, and then every time I take him out, I'll find some little thing to fix. And so this is about five years later than what he's ended up as. Oh, wow. <laughs> so he's been through the Renaissance Fair, so if you look at it, come tug on his arm, yeah. on him, punch his face, and he's not real. So at this point, he's, he's pretty much uh, indestructible. So the other one. Out of blood, but yeah, you know, that's right. He's been dropped. He's you name it, it's happy to him. Awesome. He's made out of PLA or, uh, this or is all AB ABS plastic. ABS. Okay, I figured for the strength. Yeah. Awesome, man. I, l I love the eyes. That's fantastic. <laughs> and we got robots here. I'm standing at the exhibit for Wichita State University, and we've got robots going on. Oh, we got little kids controlling robots here. We got robotics going on. Part of the College of Engineering. Of course, that's my college. That's right. That's my armor mater is WSU, where I got my degrees. So, yeah. on it. Right. My white balance will work. There we go. I wanted to get the controller here. 
Raspberry Pi, apparently. I think it's an Arduino. Actually. Is it an Arduino? It's like the destruction of computers. <laughs> Take a party. Disassemble laptops, blenders, phones, and other electronics. How are we doing over here? We are just destroying computers. Well, how, how many places do you get to go that you get to destroy computers? It's just fantastic. Is anybody figuring out how they work? Whoa, that was a long one. <laughs> What's this table? What's this got? It's got a vacuum cleaner. Lots and lots of keyboards. See, this is how you recycle electronics, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> hey, it's not that bad if we drop a piece. <laughs> Here. Yeah. Oh, Look at this. We've got total screens and everything. <laughs> so. This is, this is the part where they teach uh, kids how to disassemble things. So, we've got every, every laptop, I think, known to man. Hey, look, RAM! I found RAM! How much is it? I don't know. Not very much. Maker Fair, can you destroy computers? Totally. Totally and utterly destroy computers. <laughs> so, I got everything here. Vacuum cleaners, computers, keyboards. Keyboards, I think, are the funnest with the kids because they, like, explode when you pull the pry the keys off. So, <laughs> yeah. Just absolutely crazy. If you can see here, let me stand on the side. <laughs> it's just carnage everywhere. D. <laughs> you got an A. Because they sound so good together, you got another A. And for cheats and grins, they throw in one more A. So it's really not that hard. You got a D and an A. So whenever you hold any of the keys down, it strum the rest. Nice. Dosmer means sweet music, sweet sound. So the Appalachians, as it came over from Germany, dragging their big old pianos around, the harps. As they tried to get over the mountains, the harps and pianos were too big to get over the mountains, so they ended up breaking them down to the strings of the metal and glass. So they started building these small instruments with staples. They would have staples here for the notes. And the rest of the strings were just totally strummed. So you only had really one fret all the way up. And all your notes were here, you know.
Over here in rocketry assembly, got my son, he's creating a rocket. We're gonna go launch it here in just a little bit. <laughs> All right, my daughter's gonna go, so we're gonna look at this shooting contraption. One, go. Oh boy. We are going to launch a rocket. There it goes. It's kind of cool. It's set up with a valve. Whoa, that sucker went flying. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, you got to see this thing. Oh, I'm sorry. I walked right in front of you again. So what's this little guy? It's a robot. Right on. It's got enough sonic sensors to... <laughs> yeah, avoid things. Among other things, yeah. I have a... Uh, so at home I can set up to, to map the house with a connect sensor and then it can run around the house by itself. Oh, nice. That's pretty darn cool looking. It's controlled with an Xbox controller? Yeah, for the... Heck yeah. Okay, now all you gotta do is strap a cooler to it and you'd be great. There you go. <laughs> that. Well, seems to be it for the glorious Maker Fair. Straighten me out here. So, we're gonna be heading back now, but we got some cool footage, some cool stuff and get taken out by a tree. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. That was the Wichita Mini Maker Fair.